Chamber of Commerce. And afterwards, the Indian press asked me, do I have any relatives in India? <laughs> and I said, I, uh, I'm not sure, but when I was elected, as a 29 year old kid in 1972, before I was sworn in, I got a letter from a person named Biden, last name, in, uh, in Mumbai, from Mumbai. And, uh, I, uh, um, I said that I never was able to follow up. The next morning, I had a press conference going away, and the Indian press said, so someone spoke up, you have five Bidens in India. <laughs> and although I've never, never admitted it, jokingly, that uh, um, I found out that uh, there was a Captain George Biden who was a captain in the East Indian Tea Company. That's hard for an Irishman to admit. I shouldn't be so casual. I hope you understand the humor. But, uh, and the end result was that uh, uh, I uh, he apparently uh, stayed uh, and uh, married an Indian woman. And I've never been able to track it down. So the whole purpose of this meeting is for him to help me figure out. <laughs> but all kidding aside, I think that the relationship between India and the United States the largest democracies in the world uh, is destined to be stronger, closer, and tighter, and I think it can benefit the whole world. And I think that's begun to come to pass, and today we're launching a new chapter uh, in the history of U.S. Indian ties and taking on some of the toughest challenges we face together, starting with a shared commitment to ending the COVID pandemic. The Prime Minister and I are going to be talking today about what more we can do to fight COVID-19 take on the climate challenges that the world face and ensure stability in the Pacific, including with our, our own quad partners. Of course, our partnership is more than just what we do. It's about who we are. Even our shared responsibility to uphold democratic values, our joint commitment to diversity, and it's about family ties, including four million, four million Indian Americans who make the United States stronger every single day. <laughs> As the world celebrates Mahatma Gandhi's birthday next week, we're all reminded that his message of non-violence, respect, tolerance matters today maybe more than it ever has. So I'm looking forward to my discussions with the Prime Minister. Thank you. और अगले सप्ताह जब हम महात्मा गांधी जी का जन्म 
स्थिति बनाई है उस समय पर हमें याद रखना है कि उनके जो बताए मूल्य थे अहिंसा लोगों के साथ सहिष्णुता सहिष्णुता और आदर ये आज के विश्व में पहले से कहीं ज्यादा इनकी जरूरत है और प्रधानमंत्री जी हम आपके साथ आगे बातचीत करने के लिए आगे आते हैं राष्ट्रपति जी सबसे पहले तो मैं मैत्रीपूर्ण और गर्मजोशी भरा हम सबका हार्ट डेडिकेशन का स्वागत करने के लिए मैं आपका हृदय से बहुत बहुत आभार व्यक्त करता हूँ फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल मिस्टर प्रेसिडेंट आई वुड लाइक टू एक्सप्रेस माई ग्रेचुएट a very warm welcome full of friendship uh, not only to me but to my delegation 2016 mein aur 2014 mein bhi mujhe aapse vistar se baat karne ka mauka mila aur us samay aapne bharat america ke sambandhon ka aapka jo vision hai jisko aapne shatabadh kiya tha wo waqai बहुत ही प्रेरक था और आज आप राष्ट्रपति के रूप में उस विजन को आगे बढ़ाने के लिए जो पुरुषार्थ कर रहे हैं प्रयास कर रहे हैं इनिशिएटिव ले रहे हैं इसका मैं स्वागत करता हूं मिस्टर प्रेसिडेंट इन टू थाउजेंड And at that time, Mr. President, you had uh, laid out the vision for uh, the relations between India and the United States, and you had enunciated that in great detail. And really, that was a vision that was inspirational. And today, uh, Mr. President, as President, you are making all efforts and taking initiatives to implement that vision. And I warmly welcome that. आपने भारत में बाइडन सर ने इनके लोगों के सदन में कपड़ा डिटेल में जिक्र किया आपने मेरे साथ भी इस बात का उल्लेख किया था तो बाद में मैंने काफी कुछ कागजात खोजने की कोशिश की है कागजात में लेकर के भी आया हूं हो सकता है शायद उस पर से कुछ आगे का निकल आए शायद आपको कुछ काम आए एक्सलेंसी yes. <laughs> <laughs> मैं आज की हमारी ये बायोलेटर समीच लेकिन मैं देख रहा हूं कि ये दशक इक्कीसवीं शताब्दी के तीसरे दशक का ये पहला वर्ष मैं पूरे दशक की तरफ देख रहा हूं कि आपके नेतृत्व में जो बीज हम बोएंगे इस पूरा दशक हमारी दृष्टि से बहुत ही भारत और अमेरिका के समझ में विश्व के लोकतांत्रिक देशों के लिए एक बहुत ही ट्रांसफॉर्मेटिव ये कालखंड रहेगा ऐसा मेरा विश्वास है what i see is that uh, this is uh, the third decade of the 21st century this is the first year of the third decade and i see that uh, when i look at the entire decade i find that under your leadership the seeds have been sown for uh, uh, the indo uh, us relations to uh, expand and uh, for all uh, democratic countries in the world this is going to be a transformative period i can see that uh, thank you jab bharat aur america ke sambandhon mein main transformative dekh raha hu tab main dekh raha hu ki tradition loktantrik paramparaon aur mulyon ko lekar ke jo hum jee rahe hain aur jis ke prati hum samarpit hain hum kamite hain wo tradition ka apna ek mahatma hai aur adhik badhega And uh, this is when I see that uh, the 
this transformative uh, uh, period is in, into U.S. relations. And when I talk about uh, traditions, I'm talking about uh, democratic traditions, democratic values, traditions to which uh, both our countries are uh, committed. And I find that the importance uh, of uh, these traditions uh, will only increase further. आपने उल्लेख किया चार मिलियन से अधिक लोग भारत के यहाँ अमेरिका की विकास यात्रा में सहभागी हैं। ये दशक में टैलेंट का अपना एक महत्व है पीपल टू पीपल ये टैलेंट इस दशक में बहुत ही प्रभावी भूमिका अदा करेगा और भारतीय टैलेंट अमेरिका की विकास यात्रा में पूरी तरह सहभागी होती जाने जाए उसमें आपका योगदान बहुत महत्वपूर्ण है Again, uh, Mr. President, you mentioned uh, the more than uh, 4 million uh, Indian Americans who are uh, participating in the uh, journey, uh, the journey of uh, progress uh, of uh, America. And uh, when I uh, look at the importance uh, of uh, this decade and the role that is going to be played by uh, this talent of uh, the Indian Americans, I find that this people to people uh, talent will play a greater role and uh, Indian talent will be a full partner uh, in uh, this relationship and I, will, I see that your contribution uh, is going to be very important in this. Usi Pradhaar se dunia mein sab se jata driving force ban rahi hai technology. Is dasat mein Bharat aur America ke listo mein technology और वो भी पूरी मानवता के लिए उपयोगी हो उस दिशा में हमारी इंटरनेट टेक्नोलॉजी को माध्यम से बहुत बड़ी सेवा कर सकती है और एक बड़ा अवसर हम लोग उपलब्ध होगा the service and uh, for the use of uh, humanity and I find that opportunities for this are going to be uh, tremendous. Usi prakar se, Bharat aur America ke beech trade ka apna mahatwa hai aur is dasak mein trade ke kshetra mein bhi hum ek dusre ko kaafi purak ho sakte hain bohat si chijhe hain jo America paas hai jo Bharat ko zorot hai bohat si chijhe Bharat ke paas hai जो अमेरिका के काम आ सकती हैं, तो ट्रेड भी इस दशक का एक बहुत बड़ा क्षेत्र रहेगा। Thank you, Mr. President. Uh, similarly, uh, Mr. President, between uh, India and the United States, uh, trade will continue uh, to assume importance, and uh, we find that uh, the trade between our two countries are actually complementary. Uh, there are things that you have and there are things that we have and then we in fact complement each other and I find that in the area of trade during this decade that is also going to be uh, tremendously important. Mr. President, you have already said that in October, Mahatma Gandhi has been given a chance to give a chance. Mahatma Gandhi is talking about trusteeship. This is the case that the trusteeship is very important for trusteeship. महात्मा गांधी हमेशा इस बात की वकालत करते थे कि प्लेनेट के हम ट्रस्टी हैं और हमने हमारी आने वाली पीढ़ियों को एक ट्रस्टी के रूप में ये प्लेनेट को हमने सुपुर्द करना होगा और ये ट्रस्टीशिप की भावना भी भारत और अमेरिका के बीच के संबंधों में एक बहुत अहमियत रखी गया और महात्मा गांधी के आदर्शों की पूर्ति के लिए ट्रस्टीशिप का सिद्धांत जो प्लेनेट के लिए हर नागरिक की जिम्मेवारी विश्व के लिए बनती जा रही Mr. President, uh, you just mentioned uh, that on the 2nd of October we will be celebrating uh, the birth uh, anniversary of uh, Mahatma Gandhi. And Mahatma Gandhi always used to talk about the principle of trusteeship, trusteeship of the, uh, of the planet. And this decade, uh, Mr. President, from that point of view, is also going to be important as uh, this entire principle of trusteeship. Uh, it means that the planet that we have, we have to bequeath it. Uh, uh, to the following uh, generations and this sentiment of trusteeship 
is going to assume more and more importance globally, but also between uh, the relations uh, between India and the United States. And it is these ideals that uh, Mahatma Gandhi espoused, where uh, he talked about trusteeship of the planet and where the responsibility of uh, global citizens is only going to go up. और राष्ट्रपति जी जैसे कुछ विषयों का आपने उल्लेख किया ये सारे विषय बहुत ही महत्वपूर्ण है भारत के लिए भी महत्वपूर्ण है और आपने पदभार संभालने के बाद चाहे कोविड हो क्लाइमेट हो या कॉर हो हर एक में एक बहुत ही यूनिक इनिशिएटिव लिया है और मैं समझता हूँ ये यूनिवर्सिटी ये जो आपका इनिशिएटिव है आने वाले दिनों में बहुत बड़ा प्रभाव पैदा करेगा और मुझे विश्वास है कि आज की हमारी बातचीत में भी इन सारे विषयों को हम विस्तार से विचार विमर्श करके हम कैसे साथ कर सकते हैं हम एक दूसरे के लिए भी और दोनों मिलकर दुनिया के लिए भी क्या कुछ पॉजिटिव कर सकते हैं मुझे विश्वास है कि आपके नेतृत्व में आज की चर्चा बहुत सार कर करेगी मिस्टर गोयल and uh, after assuming charge as president of the united states uh, you have taken a very unique initiatives whether that be covid-19 climate change or even quad and uh, in the days uh, after that of taking this initiative you have made and deployed great efforts to uh, bring them uh, to implement uh, your vision uh, and also uh, today we have uh, this opportunity to discuss all these issues in great detail Uh, how uh, and after uh, our discussions we will uh, look towards how we can work further together not only for our respective countries but for the entire world how we can take positive action and i am uh, quite uh, uh, i'm absolutely uh, convinced that under your leadership whatever we do it will be extremely relevant for the entire world राष्ट्रपति जी मैं फिर से एक बार आपका बहुत बहुत धन्यवाद करता हूँ इस ग्राम में जोशी पर स्वागत के लिए